Hey guys, just want to do a quick unboxing on this um, fishing reel I just got in the mail. That's a lower end model. I think it's Korean made. Um, saw another review online, so I decided to go ahead and purchase this reel. This is my first um, bait cast reel. And um, so I didn't buy something really, really expensive, but it seems like it's, from what I'd seen, it was pretty nice. Uh, especially for an entry level fisherman as far as for this type of real bait caster. I've al always used uh, spin cast and uh, open face uh, spinner setups. So I'm going to get into it real quick. I'll let you see. Okay, what we got here. Now, obviously, if you're thinking what I'm thinking, the first um, once I clicked on it. I thought it was Shimano, and it's, I, like I said, I think it's Korean. It is. It's either it is Oriental. It's either Korean or Chinese. Um, made in China with Korean technology. It says right there. Um, now I'm gonna take a stab at that. I think it's Shishamo. And see, it's got a um, right hand model, and left hand model, and. I did specify that I, I thought the auction was right hand and after thinking that either if it's left or right I'll be I'll be fine with it and I just checked as it's a left hand but let's get into the box here hope you can see this okay pretty nice I mean box is pretty decent quality I did see another reel I almost went for half the price of this one and it just looked like it was mostly plastic and uh, don't want to go there I mean let's I won't want to spend too much but let's not be ridiculous Inside the box, as you can see here, comes wrapped in plastic. And on the front cover, you have a parts diagram showing all the parts labeled what they would be. And you have an exploded view diagram of the whole reel assembly in case you wanted to take it apart and clean it and such. You have the actual reel here. So far, it looks really nice. And you've got a bag inside here, which this is pretty cool. So, uh, pretty uh, feels like um, it's felt, but you got a real bag, so that's pretty cool. And uh, at the very bottom, you've got some. Let's see, just how to use a reel. You know, just like a user guide. Um, Talking about the drag, I suppose how to adjust the brake, the attention, um, which that's nice. Pretty cool. So, really good looking reel. I just went out and bought a rod just for this reel. Like I said, I need, because this is my first bait caster, all I used was up until here. Up until now is spin spin set up so of course this is left hand yeah feels pretty smooth but I will do another video of course on this reel once I get to go out and use it I'm gonna get spooled up with some 12 pound fluorocarbon um, so I'm not very experienced with bait casters. I've never used them. Um, Want to get into it, of course, and um, thought this would be a good entry level type reel to purchase. It seems to be very durable, very smooth, precision. I think it's 17 plus one ball bearings. Um, I didn't want to go out and spend $75 on a reel, $100 on a reel. Wind up hating the thing and just wanting to get back to my other you know what I'm used to so I did want to just you know find something cheaper I didn't want to buy bubble gum either so it seems like it's and the review I did see seemed to be pretty nice um, it's like really nice handles so I'm gonna get this thing uh, paired up on this rod here's the rod I got for it. just gonna look pretty good actually if you can see this looks like a black and silver it looks it looks like Kevlar but it's uh, 
I went with a rod that'll complement it very nicely. Same color scheme, and um, I'll tell you, I'm, I'm starting to really like this. Well, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get this thing assembled, put together. I'm going to get the line on it. And, you know, I've got some practicing to do with the casting and uh, hopefully have a follow-up video on the water and hopefully have all positive uh, feedback. And um, thanks for watching, guys. Hope this helps you out a little bit. Helps you make you, if you were interested in maybe the lower-end unit, maybe this would be something you might be interested in. But, guys, hope you enjoy it. Until next time, see you later.